Hydraulic shock absorbers, often referred to as dampers, play a critical role in vehicle suspension systems. They are designed to absorb and dissipate the energy from road impacts and vibrations, providing a smoother, more controlled ride. These dampers come in various sizes, from small to large. Welcome to Let's Grow Up. In this video, we will explain the key parts of dampers and their working process. This device is widely used not only in trains and cars, but in every moving area where suspension is required. Hydraulic shock absorbers are essential in various vehicles, including cars, motorcycles and heavy-duty trucks. If we cut the device, we will see some important parts. Upper mount lower mount, piston rod, pressure tube, working piston, driving piston, and gas charge. It is work based on the law of conservation energy. The law of conservation of energy is a fundamental principle in physics that states energy cannot be created or destroyed it can only be transformed from one form to another. Kinetic energy is the energy an object possesses due to its motion. It is created when an object moves. This transformation happens as the damper absorbs energy from the suspension and dissipates it as heat. Now let's understand how an oil field hydraulic shock absorber works. As the shock absorber is an oil filled cylinder, Thus, the thermal energy is degenerated by the hydraulic fluid, which allows the suspension to move. When the shock absorber is compressed, the piston rod enters the oil cylinder. And the oil is compressed to the gas, causing the floating piston to move and reduce the volume of the chamber. When the shock absorber is extended, the rod lifts to the working chamber and reduces the gas pressure. which causes it to rebound. Let's see this real-time animation and enjoy the learning. Friends, if you think this video is helpful, say yes. Thank you. Let's grow up. Never stop learning.